Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, yeah, so I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. What's up, Captain? Well, that was the mayor. Yeah, I'm a mayor bring him one. Magnum, he's really riding my butt about this last stunt you pulled at the Quickie Mart. Oh, my God. You know why, Captain? How was I supposed to do a little mealy mouth little twerp? Was carrying a hot dog. It looked like a gun to me. I'm a cop trained to act on instinct. And I thought he had a gun. And I had Magnum. I acted on my instinct, and so what? I he got shot. Magnum, this is one time too many. Your ego is writing checks your body can't cash. Now I need your gun, and I need your badge, and I want them now. You know what? You're gonna get my gun and my badge, you're gonna take it from me. I have out protected my kid, my son. What are you gonna do, Captain? Look, I understand. I'm the only one that is going to help my kid, not you. I know where you're coming from. I feel your pain, okay? But you're too close to the situation. You're a liability at this point to the department. Now, I need your gun, and I need your badge. I need them now. Now! What's up? Danny, you gonna talk to me or what? Look at me when I'm talking to you. You're not my father. You're never there for me growing up. You only love me because I'm the only one I can crack that one kind of computer virus. That means nothing to me, kid. I work 60 hours a week to put a roof over your head and food on the table. So don't tell me that I don't act like I'm your father. Whatever. Danny, get over here. Danny. Danny. Come back here. Danny. right now. I don't even want to, we never even had a future. Don't let what happened between you and I stop you from doing what's right. All right. I'll be at your house tonight at seven o'clock. We only have one shot to do this though, Dirk, okay? That's a risk I'm willing to take. Too uncomfortable for you. Huh. You're not talking. I see you share a lot of the same traits as your dad. When my dad finds out, he's gonna kill you. Really? That's how you feel. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but 
We already killed your dad. Oh, I forgot to tell you that, didn't I? We shot down your father at that retirement party for his partner. Unfortunately, we had to kill his partner, too. He should have never have taken out that picture of his grandchild. Kiss of death. I'm not doing anything for you. You killed my dad. Oh, you're going to do something for me, and you're going to have it done within the next hour. This disc right here, you must implement this. You have one hour, you're going to end up just like your dad. Okay, now let's go over this again. When you get the call, I want you to keep them on the line for at least 60 seconds. To Anything? trace the call, Kate. I know. I get it. I've been a cop for over 10 years. Right. I've been in this situation before. I know how it works. Right. Gosh, you really do care about your son, don't you? He's my boy, Kate. That's all I got. Hello, Dirk Magnum. You better not hurt him. What do you want from me? You better not touch one hair on his head or I swear I will rip you from limb to limb. Now give me back my son! Hold on one second, I got another call. Hello? No, I'm sorry, I'm not interested. I'm, I am very happy with my uh, tel telephone provider. Yes, not a problem at all. Thanks and you have a good day too. Bye. Did you answer that other phone call, Dirk? Kate, that could have been my son. Alright, how's it coming along? You're down to 20 minutes. Uh, you better not be trying anything funny. Don't worry, I'm doing what you told me to do. You've got mail. What was that? What was what? It sounded like something you got mail. No, that you can't fail. It's an audio confirmation. Okay, I, yeah, I knew I had the right person for the job. Keep it up. Good work. I may not kill you after all. Kate, I just got an email from Danny. I know the exact location where he's at. I want to get my son. Well, I'm going with you. No, Kate, it's too dangerous. You need to stay here. I'll be back. Careful, Dirk. 